Hi guys, Dustin here, and today we have something pretty stinking cool. This is the Exothermic Pulse Fire UBF Under Barrel Flamethrower. Now they make a handheld one as well, but I mean, come on. I'm kind of a gun channel, so it needed to go on a gun. And I know you're just itching to see it work. Me too. I'm itching to burn something down. So let's do it. I know one of the questions is gonna be, what would it do to a person? So we have something of that down range. We're gonna do some top shot tree service today, but we have that tallow tree just that was too big to mow. So it's time to burn it down. <laughs> oh yeah! Oh yeah! Looking good, looking good. So while our little scarecrow is falling apart, we want to thank our sponsor for this video, and that is Euro Optic. Now I know what you're thinking, Euro, is that in Europe? No, they're actually like in Pennsylvania. And so they service the whole US, and that not only do they have a bunch of high-end optics and the good brands that you're gonna recognize, but they have a lot of pew-pew things, you know what I mean? And it's also run by experts in the field. There's hunters, there's shooters. So if you got a question, just hit them up. There's no weird like drop shipping. If it says it's in stock, it's gonna ship the same day. So go check them out. We'll have a link in the link tree for eurooptic.com. We thank them for sponsoring this video. <laughs> now let's burn some more stuff down. So one of the first things I want to answer is how long it lasts. This is how we find out. Start counting. <laughs> Give it a little break. All right, woo, of course it's hot. <laughs> I'll be honest, I didn't expect to enjoy this thing this much, but I have, I have. Now, I'm still practicing my muzzle awareness as well. All right, so how this works, well, uh, of course it's got your fuel tank down below. Fill it up with gasoline right here. Here's how well it was thought out. You got a kickstand that just drops down and then it's level when you fill it. You'll notice I have the handle right here. So that's your standard M 1913 Picatinny rail. So that's how we put it on the rifle. It has arc ignition up front. So running off the same battery, the rechargeable battery that lasts forever, it ignites the gasoline as it comes out. There's no stupid like propane pilot light to light and keep up with. All you have to do is turn on the switch and push the button. So you have a valve, that's your safety right here, and then your master switch there, and then that button that's really easy to accidentally hit, so you always want to stay safe with it, and you have your voltage uh, readout, and it has an automatic uh, power off once you hit like 10.8 volts or something, so you're not going to suck your battery too dry. But I mean, we've put several several gallons of gasoline through it and it just keeps rolling. So you can use gasoline. That's what we're using right now just for the straight flash. You really want to get serious and burn something though. Half gas, half diesel. We're going to do that in a second, but we got to go get a tree to burn first. We have a tree volunteering right here. A uh, 50 round drum on a shooty shooty fast the lower and Huxwork suppressor. So it'll be nice. It, but see, the pulse fire makes a nice foregrip so it doesn't get, you know, too, too hot. All right, let's try not to drop it down on me. It's so fast. Let's give it one more to think about. Oh snap. We are red hot on our suppressor and flame in the front. We have more than one flamethrower going on right here. It was red hot from here on. That was creepy. Okay, so that's about, uh, you know, 100 rounds. Wowzers. It's waving. It wants to go. It wants to go straight towards that tree. There we go. There we go. We got firewood. 
So while my kids were playing with us last week, yeah. they loved shooting our little paintball targets made out of tin, and I gotta admit, I do too. You can even burst it and it's neat. And yes, I was letting my kids shoot it because that's how safe it is. Yeah, check valve, while it does concern me when you get a little dribble of fire here, it's, it's safe. All right, everything's ready, let's hit it. There we go. You see, isn't that fun? Okay, we're gonna just do a few bursts. Because you actually hear it hit the target. All right. I'd say that tree might be toast, but honestly, them tallow trees are indestructible. Top Shot Tree Service not only removes your trees, they will also dispose of them for you. So this is the gas and diesel mix, which is what you want to use if you're wanting to really light something on fire. If you did straight diesel, it wouldn't ignite because diesel doesn't have the correct flash point. I want to see what it does to the flame when you shoot it, you know, when you, when you shoot over the barrel. Now this is a shorter barrel, of course, and we have this Huxworks flow suppressor, so it's a gas flow through, so it's, it might be interesting. We don't know till we try. Oh, that's cool! <laughs> it's like a muzzle flash. <laughs> that just made things so much cooler. <gasps> well, I tell you what, <laughs> that was a bit more cool than I expected. I could put my safety zone real quick. And you will have just as much fun. You know what? It's really going to be a heck of a Christmas present. Some of you are looking. So anyway, go to exothermic.tech. Use my promo code ACC20 for 20% off. They have the underbarrel. They have the regular, just, you know, one that looks like it's a military style. You can go Sears with the backpack one. Whatever you do, just be safe. Have fun. Okay, I love you. Bye-bye. Did you see that? I came in like a wrecking ball! <laughs> <laughs>